Hi everyone, welcome back to Pokemon Crown. Uh, this is the third video in our mini little demo run of this game. Uh, if you're always uh, joy enjoying it as always, sorry I'm a bit sleepy, uh, please go ahead, leave a like on the video for me. Thank you so much for your love and support on Pokemon Crown. Really glad you guys have been enjoying. Uh, so one thing you guys kept telling me I forgot to do was uh, buy the map. So um, yeah, you're right, I forgot to buy it. Let me let me purchase it. Yeah, a bit gullible, but that's all right now, isn't it? Yeah, okay, yeah, it's, yeah, I'm a bit gullible for spending 100 Gs on a map that that's that's fine we, we have the map now uh let's check it out actually so we have our map right here we can register it let's peep it out oh sh okay hey the the region look okay okay wow pretty i mean it's not huge is there like more is like more to it or it's not the biggest region in the world but it's, it's pretty cool so these are the woods we were going to it's really really pretty man it's really really pretty i could see them definitely adding to this too i think this is uh this is a good size map i don't know what this is up here i mean obviously we're not able to explore all of this yet i imagine uh because you know there's there's no locations where <laughs> the game's not that that finished yet so I'm, I'm not gonna take it too seriously but uh pretty cool got the map now i gotta go battle the knight again because if he just looks at you in any direction he will battle you it's kind of crazy yo kill my pretties kill all right epic win all right it's more daytime now thank god today we're going to move onwards through the forest because we had a little sneak preview of it last time so this time uh we're definitely i don't know mean to save the screenshot ignore that that's not on the screen low tide dust it off dust it away uh we're gonna yeah we're gonna we're gonna go through this forest now we're gonna get to the other side just like the chicken that crossed the road uh okay maybe some new cool boys to find in here yo Oh, I already battled him, didn't I? A Weedle. Hey, buddy. I need to get my trainer level up. So, um, yeah, let's get these. Eek! I accidentally jumped in front of a ledge. I need to go back to uh, Villamont Hamlet. But I don't have any Pokemon. Uh, yes. Absolutely. Easily. Yeah. Okay. I tripped over the ledge because I was running. Oh, oh. So, I, I, I literally have to walk slowly. Okay. It, is it... Do I... Okay, so do I go back this way? Wait, what's that? Wait. Was that it? Wait. What? Oh, oh wow. Am I, is this wild Pokemon or like, oh my god, they're stacked. Seeing Zubat just reminds me of Mr. Dungeon Explorers of Sky, man. All right, go ahead, fellas. Give it a shot, man. Give it a shot. Oh, Houndour, what are you doing, bro? Why do you back it up like that, huh? Yeah, no, we got this easily. Are we like poisoned? I think we're, oh yeah, we're poisoned, right? That's the, the poison type's got the little poison effect, right? It does like a little bit of damage every uh, few seconds. That's pretty cool. Uh, it's not really strong enough to do much damage to us right now. But I don't, does it does it stack for wild Pokemon, I wonder? I'm actually not sure. That was close. Thank you. I know there isn't any more tall grass for the rest of the way home. I run a Pokemon Sanctuary just ahead in Villamont. Come visit. That was incredibly easy. Um, oh, I didn't catch your name. Nice to meet you, Cal. I'm Ear. Goodbye now. All right. Farewell. We're level 14 now. Pog, 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 pog. Making progress in life. But I just want to saw Pokemon scurrying into these bushes. Oh, well, that... Um, I, I couldn't tell you, to be honest. I couldn't tell you. Maybe maybe the commoner is standing in the way. I don't know. Whatever, we got another quest over here. Uh, there you are, Cal. Oh, it's Savgar. How long was the walk here? If you thought that was bad, wait until you get inside the cave. Before you go in, let me establish a few ground rules. First, we retreat if I say so. Second, listen to me and follow my orders exactly. Is that clear? Good. This isn't your regular cave. Both people and Pokemon have gone missing here. Po people whom I knew were excellent trainers. Don't worry, though. We're only to go around the first floor, which only certain low level Pokemon. I, 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 I don't think that's what he said, but yeah, only certain low level Pokemon. Mission in progress. So we've got to do some training with Savgor. Um, this is a little healing spot. Nice. Although I'm done resting, we can have a trainer battle. Oh God. Okay. Yeah. Let me get the rest of my guys to level, uh, level, whatever. I wish I could select multiple of them at a time, you know? Oh, I didn't mean to actually start the battle. I pressed start because the start button is usually the button that you press. To, um, to move Pokemon around in the PC box. And I was just like, oh, let me press this. I don't know, my brain is, my brain is lagging today. Silver Silk Cave is an odd aura about it. Many people haven't returned after journeying inside and the rock formation isn't very logical. If it were not for the wild Pokemon, I'd have guessed it was man-made. Ah, greetings. You must be a new adventurer. Don't worry, you may be overwhelmed at first, but if you dungeon dive with a senior member, it'll be safe. Enjoy the adventure. Welcome to the first frontier, fellow adventurer. My partner and I are going to have our expedition once our pokemon are healed up what's taking them so long man you've been here longer than me silver silk cave entry discouraged due to dangerous conditions and history okay well, let's give it a shot wait hold on let it play lotad yo the music 
Oh my word, that is funky. We made it. This is the first floor of Silver Silk Cave. Floor one is relatively safe, uh, with most of the wild Pokemon being weak. Despite this, Pokemon found inside dungeons are more feral and won't hesitate to engage you in battle. Repels do not work inside of dungeons. Running from wild battles won't work either. For today, why don't we try to get to the campsite? The Adventurer's Guild maintains campsites in notable dungeons. There's safe zones where we can go rest or wait for help. Come on, let's go. Okay, that's actually really cool. Actually, why don't you lead the way? Go ahead. I, I'm gonna just, I'm just gonna say that is actually so sick. Like, it's gonna be annoying. It's gonna be annoying for sure that I can't run. But wow, it's, it's kind of like Pokemon are too fierce. They won't let you run. Yeah. That's actually kind of sick. All right, kill this one Spinarak. Fuck him in particular. I mean, to be fair, he won't let me run. All right, do we have a trainer? Ha ha ha, the adventurers are hiding such a pristine location for us bug Pokemon enthusiastics. Oh, go on, boys. I didn't mean to start the battle. I'm rusty when it comes to the buttons, but whatever. It's all good. Oh, God. Abra, teleport away. Good shit. Yo, the teleport actually made a difference. Let's go. Yeah, now nah, they don't stand a chance here, bro. This place is pretty big, but if I stay near the entrance, then how could I possibly get lost? Oh, more trainers to battle. The bug type Pokemon here are perfect for training my Pokemon. You know, true. You are super effective on them. All right, I'm going to send Shinx up front for a bit. Shinx uh, does the little side attack you know so it gets a damage buff from that so that's what i'm here for does a back attack count as a side attack i actually don't know probably not oh we're level 15 on total now as well unfortunately we don't evolve for a while <gasps> Sveal! oh my god he's so baby look at this absolute baby moment contrary to popular belief i actually don't hate Sveal. i just don't really like wall rain that much so because of that i will not be capturing this feel but um i i will i will take great pleasure in uh in, in, in him dying Great. Farewell, Orb. Nice going. We made it to a camp. Feel free to rest here and we'll be heading back up in a few minutes. Okay, cool. Overall, a successful dungeon. A help! Anyone help! Uh, of course. Who, who was that? We need to go see if someone's in trouble. Follow me. Uh. Oh, wow. Okay. So, current progress, 6 out of 6. Let me heal. The music here is so good, man. Wait, what is what is going on? Calm down, Anna. What happened? I, 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 Beth? Be Beth? Who? Anna, slow down. Take a second and breathe, and then tell us the situation. I was out exploring with Dogwood's assistant, Be Bethany. Be you know, Dogwood, he's the famous professor. Yes, we know Dogwood. Please, you have to say Bethany. We were attacked by a swarm of Spinarak. It was as if they were coordinated. We were split up, and I've lost where Bethany's gone. Please, we need to find her. Cal, go away to the campsite. I'm going to see if I can find Bethany. Don't worry about me. I may not look it, but I'm a second I'm second in command of the Adventurer's Guild. Leave this to me. Own my title. As High Adventurer, I'll find Bethany. He said, on God, bro. Bethany is such a pure child. I don't know how I can face Professor Dogwood. Savgar, I pray for your success. Um, So do I just ignore him and just keep going forward? I feel like that's the best course of action, right? Just completely patch him. Just, nah, I'm good. Also, apparently, like, your decisions actually really do matter in this game, which is really cool for replayability, I think. Like, I don't mind if the game's shorter, if it means I can, like, play it again and, like, have a different outcome. I think that's really, really neat. Oh, wait. So, sorry, I've had a rough day. My name is Bethany, and I work for Professor Dogwood. You are? Wait. So, Cal, you must be, um... Well, you must have the way back here from here, right? Great. Anna must be worried, but before we go, could you help me find my research papers? I think I dropped them somewhere around here. Bro, she was... Dude, what? She was literally... What do you mean you were separated? She's, like, right in front of you. Well, I wouldn't say right in front of you, but, like... What? Oh, it's a side hey, dude. So I've got to find the research papers. Okay, let me risk my life. Wait, you should, we should search together. I don't want to separate again. Is that a cave room? Amazing. Oh, I would. Okay, great find Cal. This cave was not in Dogwood's notes. What are you waiting for? Aren't you an adventurer? Adventurer waits. A little sussy. Ooh, a one-star Magnemite. A single rear candy. God bless. Uh, I mean, yeah. All right, let's mess them up, boys. Our Pokemon are doing relatively well in terms of health. I mean, I guess to be fair, I have been healing regularly. Bro, what is Spiel clapping for, man? Yo, Abra with that tactical teleport too my boy is actually out here yeah you know I, I i honestly really love this auto chest i think this this is really really cool um and i don't think there's like i think there's more to it i think there's like more interaction you actually can have in the actual battles but i think because we're still early game i don't think we get like to do much amazing and also you have to remember this is a, a beta Anyways, amazing find, Cal. It looks like we've stumbled upon a nest of Spinarak. If I remember correctly, Spinarak wrap their food in webbing for when they're hungry. Yes, yes, it looks like there are berries webbed here. The webbing keeps it from going bad in this damp room. Oh, God. What was that? A Rhydos. That's not a Spinarak. Oh, God. It's the Guardian Pokemon. Careful, Guardian Pokemon are rulers of their domain. Oh, God, I have to... Oh, Jesus, level 20? 
I read it was called some speedrun to assist that you can't brute force this battle with numbers. Uh, against Guardian Pokemon, you can only use up to three Pokemon, otherwise they'll overwhelm you by calling all the wild Pokemon in the area. Um, we can compensate by managing our Pokemon's movement in battle. What? Um, okay, I have to actually think about this. I think Natu definitely comes. Some, some far away DPS is nice. My like highest level Mons are like damaged man i wish i could heal them before like that would be helpful so maybe like i'm thinking like maybe like whooper natu and uh hound hour maybe i don't have like a type bonus i was thinking about trying to maybe do geodude so i can get the ground type bonus i would add totodile but totodile's low hp right now um I, I think this is probably the best i have so um i'm gonna give it a shot use a star key to instruct your pokemon oh wow wait wait wait, wait. use oh okay wait use the uh, D-pad to select the position or foe your Pokemon should attack. Press A to follow through. Uh, oh, wow. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, wow, okay. Um, I mean, I imagine attacking maybe one of the spin racks might be best. Oh, okay. Wow, okay. Um, let's get the spin rack sorted. Aridos might sting me a little bit. Um, but as soon as it's... Oh, this is awesome. So were they just wait? Is this... Am I still like kind of like in the tutorial mode right now? Um, that makes a lot of sense. Okay, sure. Let's go for it, man. That's really, really cool, man. Okay, so unfortunately, Wooper did go down. Um, Aridos is on it, man. Aridos is on it, man. Uh, hold on. I, I need I need the puppy dog to, to kill this spin rack before the spin rack kills him. Cool. All good. Kill. Please kill. Okay, good. Uh, I don't. This isn't looking good for us, man. This isn't looking good, unfortunately. Okay, the fact that this is a thing is helping a lot. No! No, 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 no. No, man. No. Okay, so um, let me give this another shot, I suppose. Maybe I need to just be higher level. Maybe I just need better mons. I don't know. This is actually super. This is actually super cool. I don't know. That, I hope this is a permanent thing. I, I mean, I probably wouldn't use it permanent. I, I really, I really, really like this. Now that we got Totodal healed up, maybe we can try Totodal Wooper. Because yeah, we get these bonuses. So I don't know if this is. I guess if the bonuses really make that much of a difference. Uh, we can sure give it a shot, man. Let's let's try it. Use a star key to instruct your Pokemon. All right. Please select a, select a position um, or foe your Pokemon should attack. I uh, press A to follow through. Okay. I think we I think we just bullied down the spin rack on the left like last time. Um I don't know if Totodile taking damage is Oh god, it's hurting, it's hurting, it's hurting. Yeah, these guys aren't really doing much better. Um okay. Maybe maybe attacking Aridos makes more sense. Oh, the spin rack's not gonna okay. I see where I messed up. Geodude, kill the spin rack. So the spin rack is like actually like a goalie in defending this. Okay. Um, yeah, the, the poison just kind of, just kind of slaps. All right, Geodude, come through, bro. Come through, big bro. I know there's not like any super effect. Oh, wait. Oh, the Rhydo is sleeping a little bit. Nice, 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 nice. Get some damage off. Yeah, we just, we're not able to, we're just not able to get the, the damage we need done. Um, I don't know if I need to like strategize more or what. I think this is a really good way to like actually help me like think about like what each Pokemon does. So uh, I'm going to, okay, let me look at my quests. Yeah, all I really have is Dogwood's Assistant in terms of quests. So like there's nothing else I can do to level up by now, it looks like. So I think it is pure strategy. I can't brute force. It literally said I can't brute force as well. So uh, I need to level up. Mawile and yeah, let me let me look at what I'm rocking with. If I had to guess, this game probably has Pokemon in this cave that do well against this battle as well. You know, maybe Abra Natu might be the way. Those guys pair together. All right, I need to get Mawile leveled up. Can I? Okay, I can't do the start thing here. I don't know if it's something I can actually unlock or if it's just for specific battles, but that's actually really really sick. I I rate that so highly, man. All right, they're level 16 now. I could give them a um a berry. Cures everything. Can be held during 5% HP. Can be held again 30 energy at the start of a battle. Ooh. 30 energy is kind of huge. Uh, maybe I try giving it to Natu and just absolutely doming them. Oh, wait, I can evolve it. Oh, wow. I completely... I, okay. Wow, that's so sick. I completely forgot that level 16 is an Abra evolved. Yeah, let's do it, man. Why not? Toyota is evolving. Getting ourselves a, a, a new car. I don't think any of our other Pokemon can evolve. Wait, you know, Shinx can. Wait, what am I doing, man? Okay, let's evolve Shinx. So instead of intimidating with Thunderfang, let's do it. Absolute edge lord. All right, let's give this another shot now that we've got some evolved Pokemon. I've got an idea of what I want to do, but um, yeah, lots to think about, man. To be fair, I probably should have read my little guidebook, actually. If we lose, I'll, I'll read the guidebook. I think we still have Natu, maybe like nuke the um, Aridos, and then maybe like maybe like a Luxio to go run like the side of Spinarak, maybe. I don't know if... Uh, no, maybe, maybe Luxio goes around the side of Aridos. Well, Spinarak's not going to let it. 
Okay, let's try let's try this. Okay, so you can keep attacking the Sorados. Luxio just make quick work of this, and then Kadabra make quick work of this. Cool. Hopefully it doesn't take them too long. Uh Aridos is right in front of Natu though. Okay, okay, now okay, now Luxio's at the side. Kadabra is at the side. Okay, yeah, we're cooking a gas now. We're cooking a gas now. I don't know if the berry actually did much. Um hopefully it did. I don't know if I should maybe have Kadabra like come around and then attack because like right now he's kind of stationary and i don't know if firing off big attacks i think we're i think we're good though yeah we're good wow yeah he like kind of fires off big attacks to the side i don't really know why he does that but whatever cool and then they just dealt with the uh the little nest it's not over yet with enrage the guardian right so i'll heal your pokemon get ready for round two uh okay i didn't sign up for this um okay is this so now do i do i do the same thing do i just have enraged it okay um let's I think we just try, try the same thing, really. I've got so many questions. Like, I obviously, I get like a type bonus from Kadabra and Natu being on the field. But like, is the type bonus gone when Natu's fainted? Or is it still around? You know, like little questions like that. Uh, let's just give it, a, I don't know if I could have used. Yeah, okay, I guess I can choose. Yeah, come round and attack it. Natu, you can come around and attack it too. Kadabra, you can just sit here and attack it. Cool, nice. Yeah, attack him from the side. Oh, God damn it. He does not want... He, his ass does not want Luxray from atta attacking him from the side, man. Oh, God. Aridos hit full energy. Be careful. It just used a special. Oh, God. Uh, okay. Wow. Okay. So, we're not out of the woods yet. Natu's beak. Why does it look like that, man? Uh, I think I'll try and get Natu to, like, focus on these guys. And then Kadabra. You can just keep doing what you're doing, man. Yeah, okay. These baby spin racks are not even a problem. Okay, Luxio is just standing there like, Oh, what do I do now? <laughs> Luxio, you're meant to attack him from the side, man. Uh, yeah, you can just keep you can just keep killing oh wait no kadabra all right natu i need you to kill this oh god damn it i'm doing the wrong pokemon sorry it's not the most intuitive okay natu kill this kadabra kill this all right good i'm glad we got that sorted i think we should be okay natu's kind of doing bits oh my god the, i hope there's not around three because we're kind of just i don't know if maybe like moving them off the poison will help i can only imagine it would like my, my my guys that attack from like a few spaces away don't really like moving though i can try and move him down there though I'll just leave Kadabra where he's at, man. Fuck it. All right, move. We're attacking you from the side. I don't know if the item I'm using is really good. Oh, God. More. More. I imagine they probably just go away when the big man's done. I'll have you attack the spin rack for now. Natu, you can also attack the spin rack for now. And then you can keep attacking this Eridos. Cool. Oh, wow. Spin rack got O-code. Holy crap. All right, keep it up, boys. I think we're looking good, man. We're looking good. I hope we got a lot of experience for this. Like, I... Is he... Okay, uh, so I guess this is his special attack. It's just like, there's just poison on the floor and I think we're just permanently poisoned or whatever. So we're kind of just on a permanent timer by the looks of it. And there's not really much I can do about it. There's only like one space I can stand. Um, so I'm just gonna just gonna deal with it. I think we should be fine though, to be honest. Um, and then, yeah, you just keep killing the, this. I think if we just deal with the little minions, cause like they just always just, they're always gonna be doing damage. So dealing with them first. And then being back on top of the Aridos, I think is key. I think we're okay. I, I don't know. It's getting a little, it's getting a little scary. Um, I think, yeah, if more minions come, I think we ignore them and just go all out on the, uh, I mean, it's kind of hard to ignore them, to be honest. This is close. I'm not going to lie. This is close. Uh, Kadabra, keep it up, bro. Kadabra's, okay. Aridos almost dead. Okay. We got it. We got it. We got it. Not to come through, bro. Not to come through, lol, bro. Wait, why is he living? Is it because the little minions are alive? God damn it, dude. I don't know what to do. Oh, wait. Oh, okay. That killed it. Okay. Natu. Natu popping off. Natu, my little man. Natu, please. Natu, please. Natu, please. <gasps> oh, my little man, Natu. I can't believe he's the only one that gained the XP. Okay. Okay. Natu and uh, Kadabra kind of went dummy there. That's crazy. But like, Kadabra got zero KOs. Insane, man. All right. Well, I guess maybe I have to have evolutions to win. That was insane. Okay, what a relief. We managed to repel the Aridos. That's weird, though. Typically, Guardian Pokemon are a lot stronger. Anyways, it must have been guarding something to have been this aggressive to us. Okay, we got a shitload of experience. Some repels. Oh, level 18. Oh, let's go, baby. Dundee can evolve. Okay, nice. Uh, okay, looks like we can... Can I... What's this? Okay, that's just their food. And I forget my notes. Professor Dogwood is going to be amazed when he hears about this. The Aridos must have been protecting something. Have a look around. Um, first things first, I'm going to evolve my little man told it out here give a round of applause for for dundee man my fat round son all right oh wow got some treasure for here sure let me just take a screenshot of that i need that for a thumbnail maybe a clear plate 
a blue jewel, a green jewel, a never melt ice. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Um, a beautiful gem that boosts five defense when held. A beautiful gem that boosts one agility when held. Uh, boosts ice special attacks by 3%. Okay, just some tiny little buffs it looks like. Cool, and the girl that said we should stick together is now gone. I finally found you, Bethany. There were sounds of intense battling coming from this direction, and I must say, it's a miracle that you're okay. We got ambushed by a guardian of Rydos, but Cal here saved us. Wait, did you say Cal? Cal? How? No, why are you here? I'm very disappointed in your decision to ignore my commands, but I'd be lying if I said I wasn't impressed. It's an adventurer's duty to find the lost and save the troubled. You did well and exceeded the requirements for your training. Because of this, I hereby deem you an official adventurer. We're an adventurer, let's go! We do a little bit of exploring! Uh, so tell me, um, what did you find in there? Oh, okay. Um, oh, I did find a plate, huh? I mean... I'll say jewels. It said during these invasions, ancient um, Gul'darian, Gul, 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 how do you pronounce, Gul, people said it in the comments, they're gonna be so mad at me for not listening. Gul'darians? Gul'darians, I'm gonna say Gul'darians. Hid their treasures deep in the territories of guardian Pokemon. These jewels should fetch a decent price in the market, but that couldn't have been it. I also got a plate. A plate, what? Let me see it. This is a very peculiar item. It's solid yet transparent. I feel like the air around it is being sucked in. Hey, Professor Dogwood would probably know more about it. You should probably be in Lockholm by now. Why don't you go ask him? Oh, let's do it. It'd be a great person to ask about the plate. Well, this concludes our dungeon dive, Cal. Bethany, you and I are going to go back to Anna. Cal, you impressed me. And I doubt you'll need assistance to find your way out of here. Till we meet again. Thanks, Cal. I'll meet again at Lockholm. Okay, cool. Awesome. Now, the question is, can I control these guys in battle? I cannot. Okay, that's a little unfortunate. I wish I could control them in every battle because, I mean, if I'm fighting a wild Pokemon, I would like to be able to choose which one I... I'm sure there's a reason for it. I, I, I wish I could control them in every battle. I think that would be a good feature. I think that would make the battling a lot more exciting too. I know it's me just playing slow, but like, you know, I, I'm definitely like a couple hours into this. Oh my god, a three-star spiel? I cannot say no to that. Holy crap, man. No matter how much, I'm not a fan of it. I think you. I think someone said you could raise like your stats of your Pokemon in like the end game loop or whatever, so that's cool. All right, let's get them troops. Hopefully this field doesn't die first. I've got a bad feeling it may though. Oh, oh my god. Could Ah, bro, why are you firing off side beams to my Natu? You just, just trying to say hi? Okay, now nah, seal looks like it's gonna be fine. Cool. Um, I just hope my my guys don't damage it too fast. Come on though, be nice. Oh, oh no, I, I it literally just died. No! God damn it, dude. I don't think we need to damage it that much. I think I need to be more on top of it. That's my bad. So what is my trainer level actually? Uh, 19. All right. This game is sick, dude. I absolutely love this game. I wouldn't mind an impidim. Impidim's pretty cool. We'll take whatever one lives. All right, let me catch it. It's avoiding your gaze. Okay, so I imagine that must mean... Wait, I didn't even get to... What? I didn't even get to... Wait, what? I didn't even... Okay, I must have misclicked. Okay, my bad. Fine, have a lumberry, bro. Please stay with me, buddy. You're a little asshole, aren't you? Okay, he stayed. Hello? It's a monster, run away! Oh my god, it's Scraggy! He's got Scraggy, 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 Scraggy! <gasps> Scraggy looks so good. I'm so happy, dude. Scraggy's such a baby. Oh my god. Oh, hey, I can actually grab this. Nice. What's in here? A oh, one soft sand. Not bad. So there appear to be parts of this cave I simply can't explore yet because I don't have cut. I don't think you can get cut in this version of the demo, I imagine. The, the cut places are probably like strategically placed just to like make it so you don't go places you're not meant to be, you know, unfinished areas. All right, I'm getting out of here now. I think I've explored all I can. So I didn't actually check. Ah, okay. This. This is like Arceus related, right? I can only imagine. And right above Villamont Woods, we have Villamont Hamlet, a little town, okay. Fancy meeting you here, Cal. It's me, Cassian. I thought I found a great hiding place out here, but our path seemed to keep on crossing. I'm planning to settle down here. The whole traveling uh, part of my job is way too stressful. Speaking of, I'd happily sell some goods to you. Oh, okay. Okay, so he sells some wares. Oh, wait, a shovel that can dig up treasure? Oh, okay. I, I hope it's not a one-time use. That would suck. Wait, a rare candy? Is 750 G? Oh wait, no. Oh wait. Oh wait. Okay. Okay. No. Okay. Oh my God. I thought I sold my big jewel. Oh my God. 45 for a big jewel. Wow. That, that is weird. I sold the rare candy. I hold on. Did I do a, did I do a noopsie? I don't think I did. Rare candies are generally not that good of an item to be honest. I just, maybe I didn't read the description, whatever. It's done now. So as a cleric, I prefer to help charitable organizations on my travels. Because of this, I found myself at the local church. However, a bishop didn't rub me the right way. So 
something tells me there's more than meets the eye with him. Okay. Ah, we've got another Pokey Crystal. Cool. What do you do? Okay, unclear motive. Confuses all foes for 1.5 seconds. Not bad. I like my current Pokemon a lot. Any rumors? You hear a lot of things working at the inn, but nothing as scary as this. It was the dead of night, and two patrons were on their way to Creation Path. And suddenly, they came across a creature with a skull for a face. Be careful out there. For some reason, it only appears during the nighttime. I wonder why that would be the case. A dust call? It's a mission board. Help wanted. Abandoned is uh, charging coin to enter Mount Creation. He's not authorized to collect a toll, defeat him, and chase him off. Okay, that's easy enough. I have a lot to deal with when protecting the city. It's hard to do that while not overstepping the church's authority. Oh, you can actually take a rest in beds too. That's really cool. The music in this slaps too, man. God damn, bro. Bro is singing. The other music was better. I'm sorry, bro. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'll enjoy the music. Thanks. I, I really want this shovel, but like, I'm really worried that it's not like a key item and it's like one time use. I I'll save and then I'll try and buy it. Yeah, it looks like it's one time use. Oh, wait, am I wrong? Oh, I'm wrong. Maybe. I only have one of them. I mean, I mean, I guess I'll give it a shot, man. You know, he's got some items I might want to buy. Ah, okay. Oh, these aren't bad items, to be honest. These aren't bad items. I have money. I just don't want any of your items. What do you have? Ah, oh, okay. A return rope. <laughs> you know what? That's actually not a bad item. We'll grab three of them just in case. Buy two Pokeballs. I think having 500 Gs left over is not too bad. Oh, my brother does read about fairy tales and myths. Pirate King. Psh, sounds like made up to me. No one could be that strong. Have you ever heard of the pirate no, a king known as the Black Death? I recently read about him. They say he carries a sword larger than himself and that he can take on 100 trainers at once. That's got to be a reference to something. Mod check? Just came out of Silvertilt Cave. Pokemon are too much uh, fierce. I think I'm going to try and train a little more before I decide to explore there again. Good idea. What are you? Hello there. My name is Otto and I'm a clerk. During the war, I served in the medical squad with my Pokemon partner, Togi. Who are you? Cal, nice to meet you. Forgive me asking, but you're not from around here, are you? What are you? I'm an adventurer. An adventurer, huh? That sounds very exciting. I consider myself a bit adventurous too. Togi and I are on our own adventure. Uh, you fascinate me. I think I'd learn a lot if we battle together. Uh, sure. All right, let's do it. What are you rocking with? Okay, he's got a little, little, little fairy team. I like it. I like it. I like your style, bud. Look at the size of the ears on that Meryl. Uh, okay, let's, um, yeah, let's do this, man. Screw it. Why not? I think we, oh, okay, Croconaw, just don't listen to me then, I guess. Yeah, we're all good. This is not, this is not even a thing to worry about. Let's probably give some hell items to my guys. That was a lot of fun. Thank you for the battle, Cal. The church didn't provide the solace I was looking for, but our battle feels like it brought me one step closer. I wish Togi could have seen it. I just need to keep searching, Cal. I hope that our paths cross again. Goodbye. Okay. Got a little fr friendly rival of sorts. I feel like he's going to lose his shit or something, man. <laughs> It makes me nervous. Thanks for saving me. Bagon, I uh, was really worried. How can I repay your kindness? Oh, I know. I run a sanctuary for stray abandoned Pokemon. I specialize in bringing out the potential Pokemon. I could do that for one of your Pokemon. Of course, we don't have to do this now. What do you say? Uh, okay. So, is she like the person that like raises? Uh, I don't know what that means. Train Gumi. Let's, let's, let's do Gumi, I think. Here. Thanks for saving me. Oh, hey, I chose I chose Gimme, right? Choose. It doesn't do anything. Is it, is it just not complete? Should I, should I choose someone else? Oh, my offer always... Wait, what? I literally chose it. I am literally choosing Gumi. I, 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 I choose... So you want me to increase the potential of seven? Wait, I don't know what I'm doing. Hold on. Yeah, increase the potential. That was hard work. Whoopers now a one-star Pokemon. Absolute raid. Oh, okay. All right, okay. Is that like a freebie? I see you around recruit. Okay, I guess that was maybe a freebie. I don't know why it wasn't letting me do Gumi. Like, it just doesn't, it just straight up doesn't let me do Gumi. I think there was like a newer version of the game that I haven't maybe downloaded yet, but I didn't know if it like changed that much. It doesn't let me do Croconaut either. It just says, not a problem, my offer will always still stand. What if I do Geodude? Nothing. Seems this Pokemon is already the most powerful that species can become. I'll happy to help you with a different Pokemon. Okay. So I just get blanked on like these Pokemon. Wait, does Kadabra work? Nope, blanked as well. I'm gonna leave it for now because I don't actually know if it's a glitch. Like maybe I can um maybe I can try again later. I don't know. Darn these priests. They don't respect us trainers. Oh, I didn't see you there. I'm sorry. I lost my composure there. I've traveled a great distance to challenge uh, leader Matilda, but my sacrifices will be for nothing if I can't get past these thugs. You've got a dream too, right? Our journey can't end here. How about we show them a fair fight? Look who's returned, minister. Is that a tear in his eye? Have your Pokemon not enough yet, boy? Have you learned nothing? I'll show you what I've learned together here with my new friend. Imagine if I just, imagine if I just had nothing. <laughs> oh god, okay. I think this should be fine. I don't see how we struggle against 
with this at all. It's just a, a Litwick and a Bushmers. One interesting team. I f figured this guy would maybe have a Pokemon as well, but I, I guess his Pokemon really have had enough. Owned, owned, owned. Nice EXP, baby. This won't be forgotten. We'll travel swiftly through the church and you'll be wise to remember that. Oh God, does that mean I, does that mean I'm going to get like, oh, uh oh. Why did it? That was ominous. The Panga can evolve, so I think I'll do that really quick. Yeah, let's do it. I think it's always good to evolve, even though I'm not the biggest fan of Quagsire. Look at this. Look at this ugly man. Oh, hey, you again. Does this look like a gym to you? I don't see any signs of Matilda at all. Uh, this has to be some kind of mistake. I bet the church is up to something. Lord Arceus watches over us all. Only believers are welcome here as we accept Arceus' love. This podium looks expensive. I better not touch it. Ah, you must be the one that defeated my men at the entrance. Word travels fast in a town as small as Villamont. Uh, it's such a small place indeed. Too small to make room for an entire Pokemon gym. You're a capable trainer. In fact, you might have a shot of defeating Matilda's loyal goons. Without them, Matilda will surely find another place to build her bug gym. You're also a believer in peace and Arceus. I see that in you. This is what Arceus would want. Uh, not right now. No. Outrageous. You dare decline the church's order? The very word of God? Be gone. Be gone. Be gone. Wait, there's no second chances you made your choice? Be gone? <sighs> Uh, uh, what? I didn't sign up for that. What the fuck, dude? I literally, the only reason I actually said no, like genuinely, the only reason I said no was because I wanted to go heal. But the fact that they gave me the, that reaction kind of makes me feel like I did the right thing. But I do kind of want the EXP, so I am going to load my save state. Also, I was talking to this person and I didn't actually read what they said. I visited this church as long as I can remember. I'll have you know that the holy church wasn't always like this. They didn't always hold this much power. I perhaps said too much. I better take my leave. I think either way, we're going to get on the bad side of them. If we say no, we're probably on the bad side. If we say yes, we're probably on their bad side. Like, I don't think we were good either way. So, um, yeah, I just want to make sure I get healed up. I mean, I'm not going to, I'm going to see if I'm going to make sure I can go in and actually talk to him. Hopefully leaving didn't. Okay. I'm like scared of doing anything now. I was like, hopefully leaving didn't like screw me over. Okay, so the option to battle him is still there. So I'll definitely check that out next time. Uh, I think for now we've done more than enough. Um, wow, we've got a lot of content to check out still, I feel. So that's this episode done. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you did enjoy. If you did, leave a like on the video. And um, yeah, I'll catch you guys more with the, catch you guys in the next one with more Pokemon Crown, man. Uh, super stoked to continue. Bye.